I need to tell her Swift. I know, man. I just look at, what's his name? She would make me want to run touchdowns. Hey, Amen. I want somebody to root for me. I want... I need a Beyonce. Dude, the shorts that she wore at one of the games I didn't see sold it. out. His jersey sold out. Went up. Tickets to the home games went up. He was He's wearing smart. a jacket. He made an investment. Yeah, he, man. He knew where to put that. Yeah. He, that, that's a good combo, too. Yeah, it, man. There's something about him that worked. It's an off-brand. It's off-white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, it's wait, right? What's right? White? There's like the white couples that's like <laughs> white. This is like off white. Yeah. It's like, oh, wait, okay. He like a light skinned white person. You feel me? Because he, he got a lot of flavor, Trav. Even his dances. Yeah, he, the, the, yeah you know man. man. His talk, everything, Mustache, man. Wag. Mustache. Mustache, like cool. The, the ex. He, yeah. yeah, I don't want to compliment him too much. Then he start sounding with his leg, thigh me to swole me. <laughs> yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? Biceps be right Have you seen out his, his head. Big Boy's Big Neighborhood. Boy. All righty, back in the neighborhood, ladies and gentlemen. Boy, Round 58. Yeah. Marlon Wayans in the Marlin, neighborhood. Marlon, Marlon Wayans. Wait, welcome back to the neighborhood, brother. He trained you like a puppy. You didn't even say my uh, name. Man. I said Marlon. I was all alone. Right, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. But you say big boy, like big boy. Oh, man. I you say Marlon, all Big crickets. boy's neighborhood. There it is, wow. man. Sorry Marlin. about that. Okay. Yeah, man. Sorry, That's all right, man. Uh, I, I, I know you. Now beat, I know you beat, you beat your employees. <laughs> right. That's all. You, no, it's speak, not beating Marlon. It's more manipulation. I get you. And yeah. that one was easy to manipulate because yeah. she was a virgin. Hey, she was stop 57 that, man. years old. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what do you mean she was? Hey. I, the pheromones is different. Something was unleashed oh. lately. You, you don't you smell so? it. You can sense it. The pheromones, like my. Geez. You can smell it. I can smell it. Hey, man. Oh. You can't <laughs> smell it to the naked nose. You can't. Right, but, right. To a, 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 a hoe like myself, right? I, I smell the fair. Hey man, you came in and said something about it a little earlier. As soon as you first walked in, but let me tell you, dude, she was telling me about the time you paid for her at the movie theater. Yeah, it was so. And cool. And I was like, Marlon, recognize you and tell him what you said. What he said. Oh, you're like, hey, virgin. Yeah. And I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you identify to her. You know, say, hey, virgin. And you was like, oh, whatever movie you're going to, she was the last, I'll pay. The last of its kind. Now, yeah, now man. Now she got paid for herself. You hey know? man, he Aww. keeps Since saying she past over. tense. Have y'all talked about something? No, but he says this every time he walks in now. The hair. Right, you right. See the hair pony, is different. Ponytail loose, like hair. she having sex. That's a ponytail that's loose. Mm. If it was tight, that means that nobody pulled it on it. Something happened. Mm. Her makeup oh. is darker and yeah. deeper. My and, hair is darker. <laughs> yeah, and she went real goth. Don't so fall into a, this. Yeah, so it's yeah. a white yeah. guy that she with. Yeah, man. So trust her. And he hurt her. Yeah. He hurt her heart. Yeah. Not, not, not a yeah. vaginal area. He hurt her My heart. Hair. That's why she went goth. It's okay. Yeah, yeah man. It grows back. <laughs> well, your hair are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The hymen yeah, doesn't. <laughs> yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? Your fillets won't grow back. Believe that, man. Martin, you've been on the road quite a bit. I don't even know why I'm asking that because I know you have been up. Uh, <laughs> I don't come off the road. Yeah. I don't even know. Sometimes I don't even know where I'm at anymore. Like it's like someone spun me around and say, "All right, you go on to Burbank today. You go on to Big Boy." So like, I bet. I was like, "Didn't I just see that Negro?" Yeah, and you did. I was like, "I gotta see him again." Hey man, I thought these were special moments when we come yeah, back together. Man. I didn't think somebody would have to tell you. I think I would be on your calendar. You're, You're like, the only oh. thing that wake me up in the morning. Oh, thank you, my brother. Well, I, I don't leave my house. I don't want to leave my house right. before eight. <laughs> yeah, no, I hear you. I don't even go to, get, go to gym this early. I was like, I'm going to Burbank, and I'm going to see my man. I appreciate so you, I, brother. I, I always show up and show out. That's hey, how man. I do it. Now, Marlon, we, we were just talking about kind of like, you, you stay on the road. Do you ever have to do one of those things like when you see like rock bands or they don't know where they're at? Do you yeah. have to write the city down on like a no. monitor or anything no. like that? Oh, okay. But sometimes I do say the same joke twice, and I'm like, "Did I say that?" Oh, really? Though I said it because I do so many shows in a night. Sometimes, like mm -hmm. sometimes I like this weekend. I'm uh, I'm at Irvine. I got two shows on Friday, uh, two shows on Saturday, oh, Lord have mercy. and one show on Monday. And then uh, I got I, I do two shows a, a night a lot. Here's how crazy my schedule is. All right, so I'm gonna do those shows October sixth and seventh and the ninth. And then I'm going to film a special, oh. my fourth special in New York uh, on the 11th. By the time I get back to play Levity Live in Oxnard on November 24th, 25th, 26th, I will have a whole new hour. Jesus Christ. Okay, so the what you're working on right now yeah. is what you're going to shoot. Yeah. And then in that month's time, which sometimes it could take a year or so, you know, people always working on jokes. You you do I'm trying to be prolific. Yeah. I ain't trying to be all right. I'm trying to be prolific. It don't take me that long to learn material. It don't take me that long to write material. Because, you know, I 
first of all, I didn't do stand up for so long. Because even God, was it God Loves Me? God Loves Me. That was like four months. new, and that was like right in the pocket of <laughs> of time. Four months. Yeah. I didn't tour it for two years. I didn't tour it for a year. Four months. I wrote it on a stage. I seen the jokes. I see it. I've been writing movies since I was 17, right? Mm-hmm. I've been, I know how to write. I've been writing and developing and producing television since I was 19. And so when it comes to stand up, you're talking about an hour of content. Mm-hmm. I could write an hour of right. content and, and and not be like, and good content. Like I can make it a story. I can make it like a heartfelt. Right. I can make it funny as hell. You're not just filling the time. Nah. Like, man, they need 45. Let me give them <laughs> no, 45. I'm trying to be great. Right. No, no, I'm not. Look, my first one, Wokish, I think, I hope that to be the, the you know, that was my first one. I'm just mm-hmm. proud that I did it. Everybody's like, why you want to do it? I, my niece, Shantae, she's hardcore. Yeah. She's like my uncle. She, <laughs> <laughs> hello, hello, guys. She was yeah. like, I don't think you should do a special right now. I don't know if you're ready. I said, because I was only seven years in, I said, Shantae, I want to see where I'm at after seven, eight years in. And then I want to do another special after 10 years. And then I'm going to do another special at 11, 12, 13, and 14. And I'm going to see my progression every year. Why are, spe- and, 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 why are specials so hard to do? Like, even if you're in, like, seven, eight years, and Shantae well, tell you, I don't think you're ready. And, and, and she's in the bloodline, too. You know what I'm saying? And I think she's, look, because, you know, what they don't understand is, before you do a special, normally, back in the day, you had 25 years to cook, mm-hmm. Right. So you in the clubs, you learn right. the skill set, how to how to tell a joke. You just putting together five minute sets, and you're making sure those five minutes work everywhere around town. Then you finally get 15 minutes, and you go open for somebody, and you do that same 15 minutes for like five years. And it's not until the network executives come see you, and you got a half hour to an hour of material that they come to see you, and you're on like back in the day it was Johnny Carson or right, Jay yeah, Leno, yeah, yeah. or you you go burn at five minutes to national eyes. Now it's different, right? So for me, I've been famous since I was 17 years old, 18 years old. So I've been growing in front of everybody's eyes. Right. So normally. For 25 years, you don't see an artist. You don't see who he is. You, he just comes out and you're like, yeah. yo, who is that? I've been famous since I was 18. So it's not who is that. It's like, yo, that's Marlon. Did you see Marlon's special? Hey, Marlon, and when you say you've been I'm famous growing. since 17, 18 years of age, yeah. right? And we we will watch you on shows and everything, even even not just in Living Color, even Wayne's Brothers, just anything, movies you popped up on. You were a funny guy, but yeah. you didn't consider yourself a comedian. No, I wasn't a comedian. Wow, because I wasn't doing stand up. Right, I was a funny. I was. I was. I was. I turned into a comedian uh, when I was 30, 38 years old. Hey, Martin, fix your collar, man, before somebody come in and say, "Oh, look at his collar." You What's know, wrong with my collar? Here, here. Just make sure that it's popped right. Yeah, you, you good? Go. Yeah, we good. I can't. I don't, here, I can't, take that. That, that's, that mirror looked like something that you look. <laughs> Look, look, this look like you in a prison cell, <laughs> and, and you telling me they about to shank me, and I got to look hey, around man, the corner. That, that's that down the, that, that's that through the bar. <laughs> that's contraband. He like, that ain't no mirror, that's contraband, man. Yeah. Doesn't it look just hey, like dude, that? Like, yo, they come to rape you. Hey, dude. Paco and them. Paco and them. And the gorillas, both. Hey, <laughs> man, I just, I can't picture it in my head how you sticking it out, but go, but go ahead. So you. I just wanted to take something and just start shopping. Yeah. <laughs> like yo, they coming. <laughs> they coming, yo, they coming. <laughs> uh, for me, I um, I, I've been, uh, it, my, it's never the wow factor of oh my god, I've been discovered. I've been here for twenty five years, just getting better, right? Mm-hmm. I thirty years I've been famous, and right now I think I'm 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 probably my. I'm getting to that special place where I'm going to be my most prolific and my, my funniest hey man, and my you best. Say it. Every so. time we see you, you you'll say, "Man, I got something coming. I got something." You I know what I'm playing. saying? Like, yeah. And and it's they crazy because they don't even know. They don't even know. Listen, it's the metamorphosis is it's 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 literally crazy cuz I feel it and I'm like, "Yo, it's 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 going to be scary because I now now it's the missing piece the missing element for me was stand up 
I write movies. I got a vision. I know what I want to be as a star. I'm already looking at action movies and those things and how to make those funny. But I do characters. I yeah. can tell you a story. Yeah. I, I could be physical. I have all of these, and I could act my ass off. Why did so, you take on that challenge, though? Because you... I want to be nice. I'm not trying to be. I want to be a. I want, I'm, I'm trying to be the conversation. I believe goat to me is the greatest that you can be of whatever time and space you are. It's not about a competition. I love all my brothers in comedy. Right. I'm just trying to be the best Marlon mm-hmm. that I can be. And whatever those, wherever the chips may fall in terms of the other discussions of everybody else, then that's on that's for their entertainment. But for me, I feel like I'm I'm Kobe in the gym, brother. Like yeah. I never like uh, my friends know I was a Laker hater. Uh, you probably know this. Yeah, I know but that too. The one thing I can always say, like if I look at Kobe and I go, that man is somebody I just respect because his work ethic. There was already a goat out there, and he's like, nah, I want to be. I want to be better than a goat. Mm-hmm. I'm not afraid of the goat. I'm going to hit this gym and I'm going to be the greatest me that I could be. And that man did that right. every day. And so, and then if me, y'all bring me up in conversations. I, that's all. Yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm just in the gym every day. And so when it comes down to it, you know, I, I, I know what I'm doing. I, I, I know where I'm going. And, and, and wherever God got me, I believe in my talents. I know my skill set. And I'm just I'm I'm trying to be the funniest dude out. It's crazy to so called step out of your comfort zone because there's so many accolades and there's so much that you've already accomplished. That and, and comedy, it's like okay, if you write a movie and not downplaying anything, if you're in a movie, you got you know you're writing, you possibly directing, you got other people. Same with you know the television shows. There's so much, and then it's like oh, we could do it over. You know, there's there's table reads, there's rehearsals. Comedy is like. By yourself. Yeah. And that's instant. If it's funny, they laugh. If, if it's not... Ooh, it's quiet and you get hot. <laughs> yeah, it, man. The, the, the temperature on that stage... Whoo, it, hey, man. <laughs> it's the hottest place on earth, like 137 degrees. Do you remember, like... And we've had... We've had I'm sure we had this conversation <laughs> before, but do you remember your first bomb? Because you had already had so many laughs. I didn't bomb. He okay. bombed. Oh, your partner we, bombed. Ooh, yeah, but Eric. Mm-hmm. He we went and we did this place. Was it Natural Floods? Somewhere in whoa, DC. Whoa, 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 man. Hold on. Man. <laughs> All right, the name was a little sus. I'll give okay. it to you. All right. It's chocolate something, and we, we went did, out oh, there. Oh man, come on, man! Uh, it, it was a it was a bar. Oh, okay, all right. In Sorry the eighties, okay. so okay. <laughs> right. I just made the words. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Black dudes, mustaches, <laughs> leather outfits. You yeah, know, that was man. Style you back can take then. a bath in the back. <laughs> yeah, you know, like, you know. yeah, man. Oh lord. <laughs> um, but we went up. Um, I remember when I did, he went up, I think I went up first, and I did, I didn't do great, but I didn't bomb. I was too physical not to right, be Right, 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 right. I had my jokes, but you know, your first jokes ain't great jokes. It ain't not not jokes, but it was like you just telling your truth and, you know, probably talking about sex or something stupid. And so uh, I, I did okay. Right. And then he went up and he had this hat on and he always like going up with his hat on and it was this hot. Wool hat, his lucky hat. Mm. And he went up there and he bombed so bad that <laughs> he told the first joke and water just spilled oh, from under man. his hat. It was 137 degrees on the stage. Yeah. And then it was 167 degrees up under his hat. Uh, <laughs> hey man. So was this was this your first attempt at comedy? Like this yeah, and I think how, Chappelle how was there, this? and he's like, "Don't give up on your dreams, right? <laughs> You're not Damon yet, <laughs> right? Right. <laughs> but this but was keep be- working at this it. This was before, uh-huh. like, where you are now. Like, eight, this wasn't eight years ago. This was like I was 16. Yeah, so Except you try 18. it then. We was 18. Yeah. We was in as 91. So I, we was in college, man. And so then, do you take that? And I remember you was talking about how I did Chris it 60 Rock. times after that. How many times? 60. And then Chris Rock heckled me, and I quit for 20 years. Yeah, and that was a bad night. That that bomb was so. In, that bomb was in slow motion, you know something. The incoming. Um, I thought <laughs> you was a weird. Which one <laughs> are you, Cheeto? I was like, yo, damn. This man ripped into me. So he said, "I thought you was a Wayans. Which one are you, Tito? Referring to like the uh, the Jacksons? <laughs> yeah. Wow, hey man. So you already bombed. Went sixty times after that. So oh. you were thinking about comedy. 
Mm-hmm. Chris Rock t- Chris Rock tells you something. I quit, and then you quit for twenty years. I quit, mm-hmm. and then uh, and then I got uh, this movie Behind the Smile, which mm-hmm. was my brother Damon's uh, movie that he never released because he's crazy. It's one of the best. It's, once again, it's Dave Chappelle's favorite movie. Where is that movie at? Uh, it's in Damon's closet. You tell Damon I want a screening in the closet. Hey <laughs> <laughs> man, so you Dave, everybody filmed the we did this movie is about comedy. It's a, a drama oh based in comedy that he did independently. It's a great movie. I think hopefully one day we will release it. Um he I don't know when, but maybe he'll leave it to me and when he when he passes, right. he'll be like, he ain't released this. I'm like, nobody even remembers us anymore. <laughs> I mean, ah! So it's a great body Charlie of Chaplin work. Charlie Chaplin releases his, finally <laughs> right, releases right, his movie. Right, right. <laughs> post, 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 yeah, post mortem. Hey, man, Damon, he, he, he would not get back on stage. Damon? Yeah. Um, Damon's funny, right? You know, I was talking because I ran into him in the mall, and at one point I was like, oh, I don't, don't think listen. Damon getting back. Oh, you said don't listen. Damon crazy. Right. Damon, Damon's quick comedy. I told Damon yesterday. I was at his house yesterday. I said, "You funny because we always talk about comedy. He love it. He just don't like the state of the union of the people. He don't like the where the state of people are. People right. are like the of, today. They bu- mm. they're a bunch of giant giants. Nobody want everybody want to be sensitive. All the radio want to get you in trouble. All the media picks up everything you say because they want to sell airtime. And yeah, man. it's silly. And he's not a he's about the art. I'm about the art too. You know, but he's like, I want to say what I want to say. Yeah. I was like, you can, but you just can't say it like like that. <laughs> then I'm not gonna say it. Yeah. I told Damon, Damon crazy. Damon quit. I I was talking about like the greats and I said you quit comedy in the middle of your dunk you got up to 10 and a half feet over the over the the, the basket and then in the middle of the dunk you went I don't want to do this no more <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> man it's crazy Damon to me is one of the most underrated yeah oh my funniest god funniest comedians ever like I love him and I love I love him Eddie and 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 Pryor probably the same because I just think they all had the same skill set and they and it, it was game changing. Damon changed the game. Um, when he talked about his him being young and being in, he was handicapped. Yeah. And he did this thing called the handicap bully. Yeah. And he said, uh, imagine being a bully in the hood, and you know they handicap. Uh oh, here come the Crips. Yeah, yeah. What you what you looking at? <laughs> Don't make me get up. And I've never seen somebody twist their body up. He was the first one to twist their body up like that. He was the first dude to, to talk about his, 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 his... He grew up with a handicapped foot. Yeah. So with a uh, club foot. So his point of view and perception, then the joke came from his pain. And so same thing with Handyman. Like when he did it, to me, it wasn't him punching down on anybody he was just talking about his truth, right? And then he talked about his pain, and then he talked about his 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 d- divorce. And Damon was just a real dude, and I, I, on stage, and I used to watch him just go up there and just create characters. Like, to, who does that? To go on stage and just do a monologue and then leave. Is comedy an outlet for you though, like a release too? Uh, yes, mm. I, 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 it definitely is. And now I'm at a place where I'm. I talk about you know. I, t- I talk about my pain. I talk about yeah. what what's hurting. I talk about where I'm at in my life. I talk about I talk about real things, and I find that my stand up is getting really funny and really special because people are left with it's like a therapy session, mm-hmm. but at the same time you're laughing your behind off. So um, you know, uh, and, and and I'm at that point. It's it is a release. I like to go up sometime, but I don't not material. I just want to talk about this. Right. Or I want to I want to do a monologue in the middle of. I'm gonna just make up a lok dog. Hey man, monologue, when you lose a, monologue. when you lose a parent, is it is getting back on stage something that you like you felt like you need? Because when I lost my mom, I lost my mom on a Wednesday. I was back on air Friday, not because I didn't love my mom. Mm-hmm. I just needed this. You know what I'm saying? I needed mm-hmm. this. I needed the relief. I needed to talk to people. I needed to be able to laugh and still cry mm-hmm. and do those kind of things. Is comedy like that for you while you return to the stage? I lost my dad on, it was April 1st. I had a show at Flappers. I found out about my father's death 10 minutes before I got on stage. Mm -hmm. I did my show. 
And then on the stage, I cried. I, and, and then I had to say another show that night. And I had shows all weekend. Same when my mom passed. Like, you know, you, you just grind it out and you do it. I find myself crying on stage a lot. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, I got issues. and yeah. I, But I'm in two therapy sessions a week. You know, I know I got pain. I know I got things I need to discover. I know I'm trying to emotionally grow as a, as a person. But I'm at that point in life where life is fun for you kids. Let me tell y'all something. This get dark. Yeah. Oh, you you just got your little ginger taken. <laughs> oh. right, right, right. Hey man, he still gonna call you a non-virgin now. Yeah. But you know how it is. It gets dark. Yeah, man. You start losing parents and aunties and uncles that you identified with that you poured into you, that your heroes that you thought was gonna be here forever. Mm-hmm. And the scariest part is you be like, damn. I'm next. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, man, you know what I do now, Marlon? I look at kids one. and I be like, like my, 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 my wife, her little nieces. I'm like, man, when they get my age, I'll be dead. <laughs> you know, no matter how long you think you're going to live, unless they come with like some AI life and, you know, the doctors. I'm hoping. Yeah, man. I'm we, hoping. We, we, are you into all this AI stuff, Marlon? I ain't against it. Man. You know, I'm, I'm like, I, I think that it... It's helpful, but I don't think AI can. I think we can't be insecure. I think you know it's gonna be helpful, but you know I don't think AI is ever gonna replace the human experience. I can't. Uh, AI can't write these jokes. I'll tell you that much. AI well, because never, you care about your AI jokes. Never I have a great set from, I, from AI. I have a great set from AI. Really? Yeah. Oh my God, it's killing. Uh, no way. Right. No, it's I've never seen it funny. Man, because right. it, it doesn't have life experience. I've been through. You right. go through pain when AI yeah. can lose its father, mm-hmm. when it can lose its mother. When it, it can lose things and still go, here's what's funny about that. When it right. can have the human experience, I think AI will be, can re- replace Hey, can you go to humans. AI real quick and say, AI, write me a joke about losing my parents? And it won't be funny. Yeah. I guarantee yeah. you. Let's Especially read it out loud. delivery. <laughs> 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 and then write, okay. tell them, write me one about losing my virginity. And right. then you tell right. us a about joke. losing your virginity. Right. I bet you that will be And so then you're going to look on the screen and there's not going to be nothing on there. Yeah. <laughs> Like, well, well, AI says, you know, I met a guy. You know, right? That's crazy. Yeah. Then mm. I came in the next day and I thought everybody could see it on my face. You know what I'm saying? But I try to hide it in my makeup. <laughs> yeah. These tear stained faces, believe that. But yeah, man, I, I'm, I'm like, stand up has definitely saved my life. It's mm-hmm. been my parachute, man. I, I, and it's funny because when I started doing it, I was still a happy dude. And, I, oh. and then life hit. Yeah. And it just so happened to hit. At the time when I started doing stand up, and I just feel like God's given me an outlet of great expression. I feel like pain is what makes you a great um, comedian, and I've been, I've been I've been motivated. You know what I mean? Like I'm I'm not a guy that's gonna do. I'm not trying to do like five specials. I want to be pro. I, I want to be what that dude that did thirty, mm. and all of them be like, yo, I don't know which one's better. Like I'm really trying to do great specials. I'm really trying to do great things, and I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to just sell stuff. Yeah, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to be like in terms of the art. I want to be great. Reason why I want to do it, like why I keep doing specials, because I only have so much storage in my brain. Mm. There's so much that I want to talk about that I don't want to tour material for three years to get every last single dime out of the audience. I don't want to tour it like that. I want you to see it in this one, that I'm going to do it for this amount of time. You got one time to see this material live. Come see it, because I got to get rid of it. Why? Because I got a whole nother hour of stuff that I need to talk about. And I don't want to keep talking about the same things. If I do the same right. jokes over and over again, I get tired of them. Because you can't do God Loves Me again. No, I will never yeah. I will never touch well, those jokes. Yeah. Never touch them. It's retired. Those words never come out my mouth again. Those wow. stories I don't need to tell. It's retired. I don't need to. I don't go back and go. I don't try and do old jokes. I don't. Maybe you might want to. If your thing was that dope, you could call back something right, right, from right. a special. If you're, but you, you don't go. When people come see me, I want you to come see a brand new show. I, I do the work. Yeah, I'm trying to work less. <laughs> I'm trying to work more. Right, 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 right. Yeah. These are my years, bro. And like I said, I, I'm trying to work I, smarter, not harder. I'm but. trying to work harder and smarter. Right, I'm trying right, to be right. that dude. The like, smarter thing ain't working. It is. The harder, I'm talking about for me. Oh, and well, the, uh, again, I'm not talking about you. You're doing your thing. You need AI. If you yeah. and AI got yeah. together. Oh, my God, man. <laughs> it's already 
a joke about parents. It won't. Not about passing. See, it says, I'm truly it sorry for your loss, but it's inappropriate. It's not appropriate to make jokes about such a sensitive See? topic. Fucking piece of shit. <laughs> sorry about that, Come on, step it up, AI. AI is a pussy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I talk about my pain. Hey, man, but you said AI don't know pain. Yeah. Don't know yeah. pain. Yeah, man. Don't have parents. Empathy, don't man. invest in things. You know what I mean? It's like, so it can't write the human experience like that. So I'm not tripping. You know, but it may keep my black ass alive a lot longer. And yeah, I'm yeah, down yeah. For that. You, use how we can use it the way we can benefit off of it. Yeah, I want to live. I want to live like you know forever. I right. don't. I don't want to do? I do. Do you want to live forever if everybody else live forever? Bye, niggas. I'm right. gonna miss y'all. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so you don't mind story. everybody dying? Oh, I'll come visit you. Oh. Where you at? Burbank? Okay, I'll you come, gonna you gonna Paul Bear all the friends? Oh, yeah. no, absolutely. Life. I'll carry you. I'll drag you. Really? I'll no. drag your ass. I'm like, ah, he want to be dragged, not carried. Hey, man. <laughs> He don't put that stress on his friends. Hey, man, for 10 more years, would you take a year off of Louis' life? Of who? My life. <laughs> 10 more years on your life. Bye, Louis. Mm, <laughs> damn. Damn, dog. Wow. All right, he just, had a, yeah, he just had, had his first baby. Oh, for his newborn. Mm. Mm. Yeah. It's sad. You ain't going to experience <laughs> it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah but he, we're going to get some airbrush shirts for you. Oh, sweet. Yeah, we're going to be like, rest in peace, Louis. Airbrush yeah. shirts. We, we're going to send you out the right way, bro. Yeah, we're going to send you out the right yeah, way. Yeah, we'll sit with your little man. Your dad was a good dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. He taught me one thing. Always... In the cells, you got to hold your mirror like this <laughs> right, yeah. to see if they're coming for you. Right. <laughs> what did you say? Because Paco coming to get you. <laughs> he said, Paco and the gorillas and, are coming. And the gorillas are coming. <laughs> Yo. Wow. Hey, man, have you, have you heard anything since we have did our uh, I, I'm Not Invited to the Rockefeller Brunch? Has, has anyone reached out for you? That piece went viral, man. Jay don't listen to us. Mm. Jay don't listen. Jay, that's what I love about Jay. He's on. Unf- He's not fascinated by anything. He's yeah. like, I said it, I did it, and you know what? I feel like I don't want to be invited. Yeah, yeah, same. I, I, no. Here's why: because when you get there, it's like my brother used to say. I never wanted to. Uh, I never wanted to meet Richard Pryor mm. until I became Damon Wayans. I never wanted to meet my heroes. I don't want to party with my 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 heroes. I don't want to party with. I don't like partying with people and me being the brokest one in the party. Gotcha. I want to gotcha. be partying with my friends on the same level. I could learn a lot, but I know my business mind. I know how I'm doing. If I spend so much time chasing behind these people, I can't chase me. I'm and, trying to chase my own legend. And it's not like you're in the right room. You know how people say, man, being in the room brunch. with people that's I'll smarter. make my own brunch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We should start throwing and the food ain't even good. <laughs> Amen. And I ain't wearing no and nobody, pastel suit. Nobody eats there. Yeah, nobody. They don't. No they one all eats are hungry. Them. Hey, man, we should throw our own brunch, man. Yeah, and let's yeah. not invite Jay. Yeah, I'm down with that, man. No, I'm inviting Jay. He on my yeah, list. Yeah, he ain't going to show up anyway. <laughs> yeah, I was going to. You know, behind your back, I was going to invite him to tell you the truth, man. Like, like fuzzy yeah, I was just going to take this fake ass stance with you. We should make. How about this? Let's do a brunch because there's so many people talking about how you should, they ain't invited oh, to the brunch. The uninvited, the uninvited rock yes, nation. Yes, man. The brunch for wow. the other guys. So me, you, LL yeah. Cool J. Yeah, the, the unrocked uh, nation. Yeah, yeah, Snoop. How Snoop haven't been? Yeah, man. We didn't have a great Cube because Cube was talking about he ain't a part of none of it we do, anyway. We do the I. We Dude, the I in so the brunch. Yeah, we, we ain't right. rocking out. We I. Yeah. We got enough money to be I. And you ain't got to wear a the, dope suit. The, we wear I Zara brunch. suits. I brunch. Everybody oh. wears Zara suits. You can't spend over $150 for your suit. Yeah, that's true. Oh, I love this, man. Yeah. I love no this. real jewelry. Yeah, man. Everything fake. Mm-hmm. Mm. Well, let's not do it all fake like that, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and and we gonna do this, man. All right, let's we not, not gonna have no impossible meat. Everything there gonna be real. It's gonna be real meat. Real meat, and man. And it's gonna be well done, so yeah. it's tough like yeah. leather. Yeah, that's yeah, how black yeah. folks like it. Yeah. Bottom shelf alcohol. Too. Yeah, man. The bottom yeah. shelf. Yeah. And let me nah, tell you, we, man. We, when we the food no run gold, out, it's we ain't over. doing no gold bottles. We hating. <laughs> Yeah. We, we going back to Moet Chandon. Go ahead. Hey, man. We and like hating. I said, man, when the food run out, it's over. <laughs> it, it ain't none of this, you know, continuous food. We have food. Frankfurters. <laughs> Frankfurters. <laughs> and, like, we're and, 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 and beans. Yeah. yeah beans. Man, yes. Gonna, and, and, yes. And, and, and anything that we can get for free. Yeah. Uh, yes. Hi, Poppy. We going to have that chicken there. And anybody you know, who ever been to the Rock Nation lunch, they can't come. Damn. 
Yeah. I don't ah. want to see Kevin Hart at my old brunch. Yeah, nah, man. you always there with them. Yeah, you always in the billionaire man. section. Hold on. Nah, hey, stay man. over there with them. Hey, man. Hey, we, we going to be like, hey, we hey, got man. bottles of beer. We got something. Yes. We got something Let's here. Let's it. not speak on it too much. Let's Lucretia from Compton, you're invited to. <laughs> Believe that, man. This is, this, this is going to be the one this right here, the, man. Who from Compton? Lucretia. Yeah, man, she's a long time. Yeah, I don't. No, nah, no, nah, okay. All right. I'm, geez, that's okay. not the brunch I'm going for. Okay, hold you know on. What you know what? Do, though? We okay, should invite. Well, you know what? I'm going to make sure she. Yeah, let's I, not let's invite re- Beyonce. I'm with it. <laughs> we inviting Maya. Oh, man. Ashanti. Like now. Hey, man. You I'm know gonna what even go better. It's the hype bunch. I'm going to even go better, Yo, man. We're not who? inviting Beyonce. I'm going with Queen Solange, oh, her sister. All day. I'm, I'm going to be like I'm Solange. Her to the, Come that's on my down. Date. Yeah, Solange's that's not going to show date. up either, but that's I'm going to invite her. That's my date. Right. I'm, yeah, Ooh. man. Yeah, man. Ooh, we oh, gonna make us, we're going to make a divorce. Are we doing it the same day? Are we doing it the same day? Are we going up against it? We're going head to head, man. Head up. Drake's dad there now? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Drake, Dennis will be come. there. I know, no, Drake's dad. dad. Drake's Dennis. dad can come. <laughs> Dennis, right. Dennis Graham. Dennis all day. Dennis will no, be there. No, but you know what? I don't see Drake at the Rockefeller but you know what? though. So Drake, Drake could come. I, yeah, Drake, you're invited. Here's why. And, and I don't want it to make it seem like, Listen, oh, you why. know, these are lesser than. These aren't lesser no. than. These are just people, you know, that haven't been invited. Yeah. And we or people that don't go. That's what That's you call what it, it but in reality, it's, it's probably less of that. But no, okay. not at all, brother. <laughs> not at all. Look you, at you. You, think you accolades, man. I ain't on the same yeah. level. Hey, man. Yeah, nah. we are. Come on, man. Yeah, wow. yeah we are, man. Wow. Dude, I got a star on the Hollywood That's Walk right. of Fame, That's brother. right, man. I don't. Right, right, right. <laughs> because... uh, who else will come to the brunch? Mm. Let's work on a list private. No, but listen, man. we got to have Drake. Oh, yeah. Drake could be there. You know why? Why? I've been to a Drake party. Mm. He invited me. Yeah, 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 oh, nice. yeah. Oh. Well, actually, didn't I crash? But <laughs> right, right. But, but you know what? You didn't get it thrown was out. Seven. Did you get thrown out? I didn't get thrown out. He actually shook my hand. There it is. He thought man. I was Damon, but it's okay. It's okay, <laughs> brother. He said, he said I "Love when we don't play right. that." I was like, "Me too." Yeah. Listen. <laughs> so his ratio seventy five to one. Wow. Women. Damn. Yeah, man. You ain't been to a party. If if you ain't been to a Drake party, there it is right yeah. there. Ain't no so party like a Drake like party. Drake, and then look at all the illustriousness we got at our party. Meanwhile, yeah. Jay over there with Beyonce and yeah. all the all the dudes is like yeah, they want to be Beyonce, but she with there. Jay. Ah, ha, ha. Yeah. Y'all dumbasses at that brunch. <laughs> yeah, man, the eye. Right. Brunch. The high brunch. Zara hey, suits for everybody. Man, we gonna, you know what I'm thinking? When you go to the brunch, we're gonna give you a Zara suit. Hey, man, you know what I'm thinking, man? I think we even strike a deal with Hollywood Suit Outlet, man. And get them uh, three suits. No? Oh, okay. Because they give you the suits, the tie, and you get a shirt. Uh, that, nah, you get like three suits, Marlon. That's just bucket. That, oh, okay, you okay, this, okay. I said, all right, man. Okay, like, okay. All right, okay. All right. I was about to go. in ill fitted suits, like, Homies <laughs> in the funerals that yeah. came from jail got released just to yeah. see they homie. Hey man, and I'm gonna keep my tag on the oh outside God. of my suit Come still. That little paper. Yeah. <laughs> you never you can you had to rip those off, bro. Yeah, yeah, I just wanna show everybody that was a polo <laughs> suit. Oh man, yeah, if you say those, man. All I think was <laughs> you come to the brunch one of these Man, so I all right, Ani, write that down, man. Same Fine. same weekend they same do the Rock Nation brunch, man. And then we'll see, we'll see who gets more press. Yeah. So yeah, it's man. me, you. Yeah, man. L O Cool J. Yeah. Just starting off, Snoop. Get Snoop. Yeah, For man. All those that ain't yeah, been invited. Yeah, we, man. We gonna rock this. And you say who? And gonna, Jay gonna be jealous. You say who gonna get the most press? You just say most depressed. <laughs> Most it don't matter about okay. who depressed is pressed. <laughs> right. You know what I mean? That and what true. we should do is one by one start picking off some of his his boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because then it'll just be him and Puff hey, dude. at that party. Well, you and know, now I'm, we got I'm Tata. Puff. We gonna have Tata. Ooh. We gonna get your best friend. We getting Tata. Tata huh. coming to the I brunch third year. Yeah, man, third, third year. year. The first year, let him let him let yeah, him yeah, see yeah. what's happening because he gonna play OJ. Like, I heard the I brunch was all right. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? All right, <laughs> and that's good, man, because that way even with the food, we like, how was the food? All right, uh, all right. Yeah. How was the performance? All right, you know, that way, how was the location? All right, yeah, man. That way it gets better every year. Every, bro. every, every year, year. it's like low. it's like how you say your comedy shows. You like, man, I just want to get better, better with the specials, yeah, better with brunches. Same yeah, we're not dog. coming out short dog though. Oh yeah, yeah. We just gonna get better. We it's not gonna. Better. 
Pretty sure we could get a community center. What do you mean, we, homie? Or like you in a you I invited, we're all park. You in, this ain't this. No. Yeah. Community center We're somewhere? not considered an Hey, man. Oh, okay. You got to earn your way <laughs> hey, to dude, the You're going to be the big boy and Marlin of the eye. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to have a few years going, and you're going to be on your podcast somewhere talking about, man, they never invite me. <laughs> That's going to that's gonna be your thing. I and you gonna be, so. and then you going to come with the, uh, oh, okay. That's going to be your brunch. Oh, okay. Then you going to come with the, oh, a rato. All right. Yeah, all right. yeah man. So, man. All right. Well, that's, you, oh, you, man. Were you taking notes? All I'm taking it. notes. Got it. Okay, Hello, cool. Hi, brunch. Hello, okay, cool Zara Suits. Suits. So far, we got Great. Maya. Yep. So not Hollywood Suit Outlet? Nah. Okay. Zara, right. come on. Hey, Sorry, hey, I wrote it down. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Have you been in there lately? Yeah. Have I been where? Into the Hollywood suit outlet, bro. Okay. I grew up in the projects of New York City. Yes, sir. I um struggled my whole life. Mm -hmm. I always knew I was better mm -hmm. than the Hollywood suit outlet. <laughs> this dude. Right. And I and I was poor, Better ten kids in the house. For one? We walked yeah. by that store. My neck started itching. Yeah. Like I'm allergic to everything hey, in there. But I did tell you that with each suit, you get a shirt, right? And you get a you get a. Top. Why do you know so much? See, when you was big, that's where you used to go. <laughs> that, that's the perfect store. When you was big, them suits be all man. loose and baggy <laughs> over your hands. You know what I'm saying? Man, shout out to Clipper Darrow too, man. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't gonna say why, but because he's only a lot. Hey man, if you're gonna cut a, two suits in half to make one, then you you, you gotta have a Hollywood suit out there. Hook up, man. Be, 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 that's an easy call. Oh hey Martin, yes. have you been watching any of this uh, football Kansas City Chiefs with this damn with Taylor Swift popping up at these games? Man? I'm jealous. I need to tell her Swift. I know, man. I just look at, what's his name? She would make me want to run touchdowns. Hey Amen. I want somebody to root for me. I, want, I need a Beyonce. Dude, the shorts that she wore at one of the games I didn't see sold it. out. Yeah. The, dude, what's his name? Kelsey, Travis, Travis Kelsey. Kelsey yeah. His jersey sold out. Went up. Tickets to the home games went up. Well, he was wearing smart. a jacket. He made an investment. Yeah, he, man. He knew where to put that. Yeah. He, that, that's a good combo, too. Yeah, man. There's something about them that work. And she don't get mean? a hit album out of it when they, if, if they, you know, when they break up. That's what happens. No, but for him, too, he, he would, you know, it's like, you know, I think he, it, it, it's like it works. It's just white enough. I was going to say that. And just black enough. Because he yeah, still got some yeah, flavor yeah, yeah, left yeah, over yeah, he does. from the last shit. Yeah, oh, yeah, man. Kayla Nicole. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, she yeah we had now, now, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go get Kayla Nicole and have her root for me. That's ah, what you do. And at the eye lunch. There it is. Brunch. <laughs> Brunch. Oh, we should go no, eye lunch. 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 We oh. do it after. Yeah, they, yeah, because that's when you really want to eat hot dogs. Yeah, man. <laughs> yes, that is true. That is true, man. Yeah. <laughs> it, yeah. This is genius. But isn't that something? It, like, it, it works. There's something about them that work. Right. Mm -hmm. It's you know what I'm saying. Like, it, it's like a um, it's an off brand. It's off white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, right? Wait, what's right? There's like the white couples that's like <laughs> white. This is like off white. Yeah. It's like, oh, wait, okay. Yeah, man. All right. This yeah, magic in he, there. Yeah, because he got a different wall. He comes over and they and, and you know the parents, they 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 treat him like he's the black guy at dinner, like asking them all questions. They ain't comfortable with him being around. He ain't dead. Right, 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 right. You know what I'm saying? He like a light skinned white person. Mm. <laughs> 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 You feel me? Cause he, he got a lot of flavor, Trav. Even his dances. Yeah, he does. yeah, yeah man. man. His talk, everything, Mustache, man. Swag. Mustache, like cool. The, the ex. He, yeah. All right, yeah. Hey, man. I don't want to compliment him too much. Then you start sounding with his legs, thigh me to swole. <laughs> yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? Biceps be right. Have you seen his, his hands? Neck? Them big old, big old hands, they catch the football. <laughs> right. And then his triceps be flexing. All right, right. well, you're on your own, bro. Right? Right? What, right. What if, All right. What if, what if she does do the girlfriend effect where, you know, we saw, obviously, he has a lot of swag, but now... Taylor Swift to come in and kind of maybe switch them up a little bit, talk mm. a little different, dress a little different. Mm. You think that'll happen? Nah, but I do think she's gonna write a song about his ass. Yeah, that's true. Wrong. That's what I said. She's gonna give great. Material. I want her to date me, and I'll give her a whole album. Hey, I'll, man, Mar I'll, I'll take on a dark Marlon journey. She's gonna write you. a whole album. Did you see Marlon almost look at you like, man? Why are you talking to me? <laughs> 
at me. He like, and then even Wacko was like, you're not even on camera. <laughs> 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 like, what are you switched to? <laughs> yeah, good Lord have mercy, man. Hey, Martin, do yes. you not celebrate Halloween or you weren't a Halloween person for years? I celebrate with my, like, I'll go out to a party. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, I'll, I'll dress up. I like to dress up as people, as somebody else. Mm. Right? So, one year I dressed up as, well, I used to dress up as just Run DMC because it was basically easy, me huh? in a cool costume. Yeah, and that was right? easy too, yeah. bro. And my nephews, that's all we dressed. And then, another year, I dressed up. All right, well, I'm out of here. Thank you. Oh, oh Wait, that's okay. that phone thing. Okay, oh, they're that's giving us phone. radiations. Turn everything <laughs> off and get out. Hey, yeah, man. Radiation. Why did I think that that was the uh, the EAS? And I was like, yeah, I don't Missing. go down with no shit. They stole a baby. This is the test. This is the radiation they've been giving us. This is what they were oh, warning damn, us about. Damn, they me. Yeah, this is it. Now I'm going to need AI. Mm. I bet you Jay-Z had his phone off. <laughs> <laughs> so they, back to they Halloween. called him right away. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Jay, you want to turn your phone off now? <laughs> yeah. I bet you Travis Kelsey's phone is on. Yeah. I bet you Taylor Swift's is off. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. we about to run this I test. bet you Kayla Nicole's phone is on. Just wanted to, yeah, just wanted to give you a heads up. Uh, I don't about know, to run that's a tough choice. That's yeah. a shoot. <sighs> Man. We back to Halloween. Oh, I'm talking about yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, so yeah, see how this thing is? Right that's, that's, like, that's like that, MI, that, that mini black, black zapper. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? As soon as okay. that sound went off, we all lost our minds. What was I saying? You, you were saying about oh, how- Okay, so one year, I, I, me and my nephew, we went to uh, my buddy Open Catch Vegas. My buddy Mark, shout out to Mark Burnbound. Damn, they zapping us with more rays. We ain't gonna, I'm definitely taking a year off your life. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> And you supposed to be telling us about this. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> you don't feel weak. Hey, man. Yeah. Weak. Hey, dude. Oh, like, I, like I tell people, I don't go down with the ship. <laughs> oh, I, we all like, going down like, together. Like, oh, we my, locking the door right my here. My job, my responsibility is if something goes on, I'm supposed to sit here and tell you. Mm. This is what's happening. Yeah, that's true. That's oh, my job. Happening. Yeah. No. There's I will us. leave. <laughs> if you waiting on me to tell you that there's something going down, you're gonna oh, have man. to literally. Oh, I'm gone. Catch me. I heard something at your your show that you had me at, and I didn't like it. Really and, though. Yeah. I started moving to the left, and I was like, oh, that wasn't a gunshot. Oh, oh. Okay. And y'all was on stage, right? Uh, y'all the ones about to know what happened. Well, thank you for giving us a heads up yeah. that we were you all wasn't in. Get no heads that up. We, I can tell. You, you, t- you tell me a month and a half going. later. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, tell me a month and a half later, Marlon. Well, you know. Thank you. I'm a friend. Hey, man, do you watch scary movie okay, around I, this time I, I, of the year? Wait. I'm just So another year, I went <laughs> and I was dressed up as Sam Jackson in Pulp Fiction. Yes, sir. But my nephew was dressed up as Sam Jackson in real life. <laughs> <laughs> How does that happen? My nephew Greg, Google it. Oh man, it's on my is Instagram. His name, is his name Greg Wayne? Greg Wayne. He's dressed up. He had the he had the you know I had the mustache, from furious style. I had the jerk curl. I was I kept screaming at people the whole night. I will, and he just had on um, a Kango to the back like Sam Jackson oh, in the real that's life. Dope. <laughs> Can he pull it off? It was people was just like, who are you? They knew who I was. They was like, that's a great costume. They go, who are you? And he go, I'm Sam Jackson in real life. And then people <laughs> crack wow. up like, hey, why man. that costume? It so worked. What my uncle would give me. Right, right. It, 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 it I wanted to be a star. And then the lastly, I dressed up one year for Halloween. Everybody was dressing up like as uh, it was the year that what's it? Hugh Hefner died. So I dressed up as Jerry Relen- Jerry Lorenzo, dressed as Hugh Hefner. So you you couldn't just hop over to, nah, because I had all this dope Fear of God stuff and I wanted to wear it, and I had this ponytail wig and I wanted to wear that for leftover from Sam Jackson. So I put mm-hmm. Jerry Lorenzo, who owns Fear of God, mm-hmm. and I dressed cool like Fear of God, but I had like five Playboy girls with me. Ah, so I was, gotcha. and then I had a yacht hat. So I was Jerry Lorenzo as Hugh Hefner. Mm, uh-huh. Follow the bouncing ball, you feel right? That? Yeah, that was very difficult. I just like confusing people yeah, on Halloween. Very much so. Who man. are you? That's very why I want to much like, so. Who are you? I'm Damon. Mm. <laughs> you can pull that one off though. No. I I actually pull off Sean. I'm gonna be Sean this year. 
Really though? Hmm. Yeah. The Sean... he, he handsome and he can get laid. Maybe that'll, <laughs> that'll help my chances. Hey man, do you watch scary movie as much as people watch? And I'm talking about like the 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 one the, we did. Yeah, like the good one. No, nah, we did that. You know, I, you don't watch. I don't. Hey, I don't watch my work. Right. I I said it. I did it. I leave it alone. I don't want to recreate. I'm about looking at new stuff. I don't look at my specials. I don't look at nothing. And Every, we've had this conversation it, before, man, where uh, people always asking about white chicks. I think that'd be one of them things if we ever lower you, lower you to the By ground. the time we do, it's going to be old white chicks because mm-hmm. these people will be acting like this isn't a half a billion dollar franchise. They funny. Yeah, they, so, don't, so uh, they don't see. It's a ha- it's, tell them, I'm telling you right now, white chicks too. Would be probably the biggest comedy. Bring back yeah, comedy. Man. It'd be one of the biggest comedies ever. But these studios want. Well, can you do it for twenty million dollars? We didn't do the first one for twenty million dollars. Why are you gonna give us that budget? Meanwhile, Tom Cruise gets three hundred million dollars to do Mission Impossible thirteen, mm-hmm. and they want to give right. us twenty million. No, so man. It, it, it's not that you guys don't want to do it. It's these studios like they got to come correct, especially since if we got to make a better a movie big... than the movie we did first. That's made. what I'm about to say, man. So I'm not asking for crazy budget. I'm not like, well, yo, we need a hundred million dollars, but you need a fifty, sixty million dollars to make that movie. I would, and you know, as a fan, people want. I to didn't see it. sleep when I did the first one. You understand? Me and Sean, we did seven hours of makeup. Oh lord! And then we worked fourteen hours after that, and we pushed our call time the whole entire time. We forced called ourselves. So we only slept three hours a day for about 50 days. No, we need a budget so I could sleep. I'm not, I'm, I couldn't do that in my, uh, at, at 50. I'll mm. die. I'm not dying in white chick makeup. You ain't buried me. <laughs> yeah, that is, I'm sorry. That is true, man. Unless AI find a way to make this happen a lot quicker uh, yeah. than uh, the makeup more than quicker than seven hours. Seven hours of makeup is a lot of work. It's a lot of work, but I mean, story wise, it'll be dope. Did you know it's gonna be the hit that it that it is? Not was that it is the phenomenon. It's when you're doing it. I was talking to who was I talking to? I was talking to I was talking to somebody. One of my, one of my agents. He's like, "You need a hit. You all you need is." I said, "Bro, all I've gotten is hits." <laughs> I've been doing this thirty years. Don't be a menace. They didn't know it was like where'd that come from? Hit, scary movie. Hit. Hit. I mean, and we all these for no money. Money. We're doing these movies for like, I mean, scary movie cost us nineteen and made three hundred fifty million dollars worldwide. Back, back then, it's yeah. like white chicks. We made for thirty five million and made one hundred and forty worldwide. Mm-hmm. Like, bro, it's like we. Uh, I did haunted house for a million and a half dollars and made seventy million dollars worldwide. That's crazy. I know how to make a movie. It's like at some point. You know, that's what I'm. I'm. I'm looking at my business differently. I just want to go. I. I first couple, of, first years. I. I did a lot of great movies with a lot of great partners. Made people a lot of money. Now I really want right. to do. I want to. I know my business. I want to do my business. We should fund it ourselves, man. I put in like thirty two hundred. Um, <laughs> when you said we, I didn't understand. I uh, why. Um, it was we. Uh, I thought. I just know that was the right, uh, what's the word? Preposition? Uh, Proposition? What, we. Uh, right, okay. It's like when I, if I was like, oh, we know when we should do the radio show. Right. Right? We, 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 if we going to do it, then. But I'm, I'm talking about if we want to see it, we right. should fund it ourselves, man. Right. And so, I go to 3500 Yeah, that don't make us we. That makes it. But I'm talking about we get like investors too. Yeah, but like I, I'll invest. I, but I don't need your thirty five hundred. I need you to focus that on the on the eye lunch. Okay, because that ain't <laughs> gonna make a dent where where mm. we trying to do white chicks. Feel me? So let's say you're just, just stay looking focused. at the thirty five hundred from me. You're not yeah, thinking well, about I, this like the hundred fifty from Lou. I got about hundred fifty. Yeah, easy, bro. Yeah, that's not. I the need weed. help with makeup. Yeah, that's not. I can do makeup. Wacko's good on cameras, man. Yeah, but I, I'd rather it just be me. I think let's oh. take the W and we mm-hmm. and turn that upside down. Okay. <laughs> hey, right? Okay. And so. let's go me. Cause I don't I don't think I need thirty five hundred dollars. Mm. Right? And in mm. one fifty? You hold that by, easy, bro. Buy, buy, hey, your, he baby, buy your baby some pampers. And what you, what you gonna do? Makeup. She gonna help makeup. with makeup. Yeah. Well, you and put this, I don't believe camera. your makeup because you did this makeup and that's supposed to be, I'm still a virgin makeup, but it's not. You got whole makeup on. I see it. Oh. I guess. Okay. Right. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what? Yes. 
just the same way we're going to start our own lunch. <laughs> We're a production company, you guys. Oh, yes, we are, man. Right. Right. The three of you guys. Yeah, man. The four of us. No, I'm yes. good. I'm good. No, no, the four. You no, already got partners. No, you know. I got Keenan and Damon and Sean. Oh, and what on, do they do? Okay. <laughs> uh, just the family brothers, Wayne's brothers. Right, right. Is like family. And oh man. You, yeah. Even though you, you have do you heard of the big wack Luani? The who? The big wack Luani. <laughs> Come on, homie. Oh, this dude, Stop the production it. company. IMDb is, bro. The, yeah. the big Wack Luani. No. I'm uh, big. That's Wacko. That's Lou. Louie. And that's Ani, bro. Right. So that's a great name for y'all production company. Yeah. I I, I put in. Jealousy. I'm going to put in. No, I'm going to put <laughs> yeah. in $32. So salty, and, and, and I'm going to help fund y'all first movie. Right. Okay. What's $32. That, hey, hey, dude, watch that $32 grow. You going you gonna to give us $32? If not, it's And hard. I'm bringing you back $40. <laughs> you going to wish? Yeah, that's, you, you know what? You the same person that say, didn't in, invest in Uber 32. when it came to you early. You <laughs> you, you would have slept on Amazon. You would have you, no. you, you slept, you would have slept on in Amazon. No, you wouldn't. I have tried to because Big Walu and Ani, you're not even with us. Yeah, yeah. So, it doesn't have the same ring as Amazon. Mm. Right, Big Black because Wu, Ani, Ani, because Amazon already made it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna stick with Wayne's brothers. I think that's nice and simple, <laughs> right? Mm-hmm. Wayne's brothers. It got a ring. Yeah, it right. does. Right? It does. Right. Because she is but you know what? If you always want to be connected to I, that, you know I, what I'm saying? Yeah, but you know, I'm like, it's time to go solo. We could have been solo. Big Wag Lou Marani. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Let's stay focused on this brunch. <laughs> okay, all right. brunch. So this weekend is going to be, I, I call this the Kunta Kente tour when y'all do this many shows. <laughs> Friday at uh, Irvine Improv. Yes. It'll be Friday. There's a 7.30 show. There's a 9.45 show on Friday. Saturday, which is the 7th of October, mm-hmm. there's a 7 p.m. and a 9.30. Yeah. And then when people don't even do shows on Monday, you're coming back on Monday yeah. and doing a Monday night, 8 p.m. Tickets are available at uh, tripledoveimprov.com slash Irvine. Yes. And it's a lot of work, bro. I, I like the grind. And then, then November 24th through 26th, I'm at the Levity Live in Oxnard with a completely different show. Hey, man, is it different performing at the house as, it, as opposed to the road? Nah, um, I just like it doesn't matter, man. Like at a point when you when you get, I I believe when you get good enough, you know, I think it's it's the same place everywhere you go. It's the same. I don't care how many people it is. I don't care if it's three hundred or th- three thousand. It's the same energy. It doesn't matter who's drinking what, what time it is. It's the same thing. You know your stuff. You go in there and you rock it. Don't matter if I'm uh, at home or if I'm on the road. I give the same show. Are the ticket requests different at home? I hate being home. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I wound up making a dollar fifty because everybody's like, yo, I'm going to bring me and my, I'm, I don't pick up my phone. Y'all going to buy them tickets. Mm. Hey, man, I, I love how people got you or everybody want to come and hang with you. But if you were work for like a moving service, nobody want to come to work with you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Comedy or when something yeah. is exciting, everybody yeah. want to be with everybody you, Everybody want to be part of the good show. But, yeah, you know, man. It's all right. But I, I I don't I don't give away tickets. I'm like, I'm like I I just ignore your calls that weekend. And this and is see who my real friends are. And this is all new material once again. Um yeah yeah. And and this is this what you're preparing for the special? Yeah, my special is about uh, um it's called Good Grief, and uh, it's about mm. it's about uh, dealing with the loss of my parents. That's a dope name, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, that's an amazing. And you shooting that in November? November, uh, uh, November 11th at the Apollo in New York because my mother and my oh, father wow. grew up in Harlem, and my mother performed at the Apollo when she was a little girl. And uh, my brother Damon did his second special, The Last Stand, at the Apollo. So I wanted to um, oh wow go do it in my hometown of New York City in Harlem with my parents. Have up. you ever performed at the Apollo? Nah. Oh wow! Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. But you've been in the Apollo, like, like it's a beautiful theater. Yeah, it is, man. Beautiful theater, and it's extremely has so old much school. history. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, when I walk out, I'm gonna rub that wood. Yeah, man. Even though it got everybody mojo on it, and who knows who skeeted on it, and yeah. who, who had wood <laughs> on their hand, but you know that wood, I gotta rub the log, and I'm gonna go do a great show. I heard that, man. And, go and, do something legendary, and, a legendary theater, talking about legendary people. And you know, it's a trip. Did you feel like? You were ready for what it is right now with good grief and to do it at the Apollo, like all that kind of like the You know how when they say the universe, the sun, moon, and stars yeah. align, is this it for you? Um, 
I don't know. God whispered to me and told me that this is what it should be. And so, you know, I, I'm, I'm making it happen. So it's a vision that I had and it's a vision that I have. And so I, it, it's the special I want to do. And so, yes, it's all divine. God talked to me and was like, this is what I should do. I woke up with a vision mm -hmm. and I know exactly how it's going to look. I know exactly how I want to perform it. I know exactly, you know, uh, uh, what my process is going to be, how it's going to end. I see it and I'm going to execute the entire vision. Hey, man, do you get nervous? Never. No? Nah? No. Nah, I used to get nervous, and, and I realized that my nerves was getting getting in the way of my uh, success. I think in order, I think to be excited is better than nervous. Nervous is a right. feeling that you're going to be defeated. So mm. I don't get nervous. I don't like listening to anybody before me. I don't like listening to other comedians. I don't like I don't like turning it up. What jokes they do? I don't I don't care if I'm on a bill with ten people. I don't want to hear what you got to say. Really? I so, go on, so I go on. I do my show. When That's you're in all. your dressing room, no, you don't listen to nothing. Do you, do nothing. you have conversations with Turn people? Turn it down. Um, I like to be by myself. Okay, so you don't have like a noisy dressing room. No. I don't drink before my shows. Right. Like I don't, I don't do. I could if people come in, I can say what's up and do all that. They can have drinks and enjoy. But you know, if I, I don't need to be quiet. I don't. I don't have a process. My process is all right. They might get dapped from my nephew, and the, I say what's up to whoever's in my dress room, and then I, then I go out on stage and walk off and, and do my thing. But I think the important thing is to get calm, right? To be regular. Right. If you hype, I used to hype myself up. And then on my first special, I came out, and I was just so hyped. I was like, hey, what's going on? <laughs> and I had 3,000 people looking at me like, okay, like, calm What y'all doing back there? Yeah. I felt like a cartoon. Right. And so I had to ground myself. And then once I did that, I realized that's the artist that I am. I'm not somebody that needs to, because my brother Damon, Damon will be backstage. He'll be singing Michael Jackson. And, you know, because we love the Jackson family, so he'll be singing uh, uh, the Jackson 5, and or he'll be doing, like, just getting himself hyped up. Because as an artist, he's much more, like, chill. Me, I'm crazy as an artist, and so I need to calm down and sit in pocket. So that's my process. Hey, Marlon. Yes. Before you get out of here, man, I I've been doing this with uh, people that come to the neighborhood. Marlon, do you know this sound? Can you do it again? Yes. It sounds like someone's about to drop a freestyle, and then it was like, nah, I put on a different beat. Mm-hmm. Because I was about to be like, yo, check it out when I check it out. Me and my friends, we go to, no, no, no. Hey, man, when you said play it again, yeah. I knew you didn't know it. Mm -hmm. what, what, what is it? It's the uh, the thing for Pornhub. You don't watch porn? I, I'm 50. I don't be touching myself like that. Yeah. Hey, man, let me tell you. Yeah, you know I mean? Like, I, I just think Hold there's on. a certain Hold on. point let me, in your let me life tell you, where it's bro. like, yo, man, Louis, I don't want to Louis took my innocence a few, what, a few months ago? Yeah, yeah. I had never, I didn't know what. I want to make a beat with that. I didn't know what this was. That. I want to beat you know up what? a beat But now, beat bro, with that. now you know. Yeah, but we I want to. just messed it up let's for you. Do, but now we should do a, a, a freestyle. Over it, yeah. Mm. Like someone need to make a beat we with that beat. We're gonna have to loop it now. We're gonna have to I'm loop serious. it now, man. Not, we can we make have money it by. On, that's we. Hey, do right we there. have it by the time the lunch come around? The we, I lunch. The I lunch. <laughs> yeah, that, man. That'd be the theme song. Yeah, it won't be like this. But we we'll take song. it and do it somehow. Seems wrong. Yeah. And sometimes we do this. We black and we stay strong. I'll be having sex for short times, not long. Yeah, man. Ooh. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. I smoke my hey, blunts. So I don't touch the bong. Hey, man, let me like tell you. like a ding dong. Mm, like King Kong. Ooh, and it's a mean schlong. Yeah. That's what the ladies slay. Yeah. Did we say ping pong already? Ooh. Yeah, man. Hello. That's one of them things that be like the, I'm the new king. Oh, you hear the ring? Oh, oh. you going back now? Then you, they now you're going to ING. And now the silent sound is silent. Whoa. Why? Marlon Wayans in Jay the neighborhood. Jay-Z gonna want us at the, at the brunch this year. Big boy's neighborhood.